manager of the Kasima and the entire business community, I would like to welcome you all to this special days of Nigerian Double Insurance Corporation and ongoing 40 years kind of international trade plan. I believe it is a good opportunity and having to the NDIC in order to enlighten and participate in and the general public on objective and mandate of the corporation. For the fact that many depositors are not even aware of the NDIC system, NDIC system. I want to use the opportunity to express our appreciation to the entire management of the NDIC being the participant to kind of intentional prepare and I wish the NDIC will be partnering with the chamber in, the, in, the, in her activities. It is our hope and cooperation we maintain the position as a partners and mutual benefit and understanding. Similarly, Kano Chamber of Commerce went to use this opportunity to convey appreciation to the current managing director and chief executive uh, of NDIC, Malam Omar Ibrahim, NMI, in, in, in his effort to ensure a zero, zero tolerance for corruption in the operation of the IC and hosting a special day in this international trade bank, Kano, Kaduna, and Inugu uh, Chamber of Commerce. This is commendable efforts, hosting of commerce, industry, agriculture in Nigeria. Since when we were established in 1989, we have discharged this function effectively. We ensure the banks, and in the event of bank failure, we give bank customers the insured sum at the initial stage of 500,000 for conventional banks and 200,000 for microfinance. But that of the uh, conventional bank covers even pass through that is uh, non-interest banks, what you call Islamic bank, and even pass through mobile money operators, we give the same kind of this. The second mandate is bank supervision. We, in, in a joint teams with the Central Bank of Nigeria, conduct the inspection a monitoring of all licensed banks in Nigeria with a big to ensuring that they are operating according to laid down rules and regulations of the banking industry. Here in the trade fair, if you go through our list of visitors, we it's, it's in hundreds. We, if you go through it, you'll find out uh, a lot of bank customers come in with their complaints, ranging from uh, ATM fraud, uh, with uh, non-payment of withdrawal deposits and what have you, and hacking into their accounts, excess bank charges, and uh, excess UOT and interest on loans. Some we've been able to call their bank branches from here, we've resolved some issues here. Others that we are unable to resolve, we'll send our examiners to those banks to put the case before them so that we'll be able to resolve it on behalf of the complainants.